Let's talk about paper, its uses, about the people who make it. Let's talk about protecting nature and recycling. This is the story of how paper is made. Everything starts in a nursery with small pine or eucalyptus trees that are planted in the soil, just like apples, tomatoes, rice, plantains, and so many other things we need in our life. For example, chocolate is made from cocoa, sugar is extracted from sugarcane, clothes are made with cotton, and wood is needed to make paper, board and cardboard. Wood provides long or short fibers that allow those products to be the best. After planting the seeds, a small tree grows and is taken along with many others to begin a forestry plantation, where they will grow until they mature and they're ready for harvesting. Often, amid these plantations, there are natural forests, where many plants and animal species live. And one of them is the Barranquillo, a very good friend of all the trees. He is delighted to know that when the time comes to harvest the pine and eucalyptus trees, the people who make paper take care of natural forests and protect him and all his other friends. This wood, harvested by a large group of people, is taken in trucks to factories. A large amount of recovered material is also collected. It can only be used up to seven times, so it needs to be reinforced by the strong fibers of wood. In the factories, wood is turned into small chips, and along with the recovered material, goes into something like a kitchen, where with a lot of heat, the cellulose fibers of wood are separated and pulp is formed. Pulp is something like a paste that is spread on a long material that is moved by rollers, which remove water and help it to dry in order to form large paper rolls. These rolls are used to manufacture cardboard, sacks, and paper bags, and the paper you use for schoolwork in having fun. It is very important for you to remember that paper is good and you can use it knowing that it is produced, thinking about our environment. If you recycle paper and cardboard, you help to continue the paper's life cycle. As you can see, paper is a very important part of your everyday life. And always talking about preserving nature and the future of our planet, those who make paper from wood protect it for you and for everyone around you.